Melbourne Water, along with local councils, manage the stormwater drainage system across the Melbourne area. And the Edith Vale Seaford wetlands work as a part of this system. Stormwater flows in here when it rains. This is Graham. He works for Melbourne Water and knows all there is to know about stormwater drainage in this area. The Karam Karam Swamp is the area at the bottom of the catchment which waters came from Dandenong Creek, Yamemering Creek and also from Boggy Creek. The water once it got into Karam Karam Swamp could not get into the bay because there's a sand dune that runs parallel with the beach. Without an outlet into Port Phillip Bay, all the water from the creek slowly filled the areas between the sand dune and became a big wet swampland, stretching from Frankston to Mordialloc and all the way out to where Dandenong is now. In the late 1800s they decided to drain the swamp and the way they decided to do that was to put a cut through the sand dune where Patterson River is now. This cut was made in 1879 and it was 30 feet wide. Two years later there was a very large storm and the cut ended up 300 feet wide. Over the next 100 years, engineers continued to drain the swamp by creating creeks like Mordialloc Creek and Eel Race Drain to carry all the water away from the area. All this work eventually dried up the land, making it useful for grazing and housing development. Thankfully, two portions of the swamp were preserved and became the Edith Vale and Seaford wetlands that we know today. It is essential for the wetlands to remain because they are an important environmental site. They are very important to the drainage system that it stores floodwaters and prevents the housing from flooding. There are plenty of ways you can help ensure the stormwater that flows into the wetlands is healthy. Check that your car isn't leaking oil or petrol that could escape down the drain. If your dog does a poo, pick it up and put it in the bin. And if you have any litter, also put that in the bin and make sure the lid is on secure and tight. It's pretty simple and that will help keep our wetlands healthy. Because not only is this wetland a beautiful home for birds and animals, but it also plays a significant role in our drainage system.